Alrighty then. And I can pan my cameras back up a little bit. Level it out, make it a little more natural. The ground is soft here. Let me pan down again. It's the natural light. There's enough light and moisture in here. You almost got a lawn growing. So I'm gonna go around so I don't trample it too much. It's kind of neat. Now look at these cracks. Like I said, the actual rock here is black or gray. You know, silicate. And then, uh, there's green stuff growing on it. Very interesting. You see, there's enough water here. It's like a creek flowing. Not right now, there's no water, but I mean, during the rainy season. In fact, it rained a couple weeks ago, so. Maybe someday I'll be brave, come here when there's rain. What in the world? Oh, I see, there's just one small hole, like a rock is missing. Interesting. All right, same thing. I'm going to go in counterclockwise. Notice this hole in the wall, and then there's like multiple levels of rock in there. Layers. Very interesting. how green it is on the floor there very pretty <sighs> all right no sign of bats yet but that's what i said on the other end and i didn't notice the bats until i was leaving so yeah can't always listen to me i, I was wrong once about 10 minutes ago it wasn't pretty all right here we go notice how there's a huge rock in the way guess i'll just have to go around eh? I'm just looking for good footing so I don't plummet to my doom. Notice this room ahead. It's like 30 foot high ceiling. Crazy. First, I want to see what's over here. Wow. See, I could climb down below, but I'm feeling lazy right now. So instead of going down below, I'm going to stay up here. Yeah, it looks like there's nothing up there. All right, never mind. Just have to be careful when I'm walking on rocks to, you know, step on a rock that's not going to roll away under my weight. See, I don't see an easy way down. I'm going to have to like, go the long way. All right, fine. Wow. I was planning to stay to the right side, but it looks like the left side is going to be a lot easier. Since I'm not here to die a horrible death, I'll take the easy way. Wow. Let me pan up while I'm here. Because this is just... So there's like a room here. A bubble. Where the ceiling is dozens of feet high. I'd say at least 30 feet high. Maybe 40 feet high. It's nice and round. Like it was formed by an air bubble or something like that. It's kind of smooth on the right. Oops. Let's see if I can uh, get down here. I'm still about six feet up off the bottom. Gotta watch my footing. There. Wow. How's that for an interesting little place? You can see it's nice and smooth up there. People have been climbing up there. I'm not that breath. I don't have any vertical gear, so if I climb up there, there's nothing to make sure I get back down alive. I would hate to get myself stuck up there. 
I'd feel pretty stupid if I did that. Mm. Just remember, 911 doesn't work if you don't have cell phone service. If you don't have cell phone service, well, 50 feet underground. <laughs> there we go. Wowzers. Yep, it's just a little bit interesting back here. Oh, cool, found a shortcut. All right. Notice the layers of rock here. Like one is thick, like they're artificial. Thick cave. You can see it's not the simplest, easiest cave. A squealing noise was one of my flashlights. Piece of junk. All right, anyway. Oh well, if I find something better. Now, I don't approve of vandalism in a cave, but. Once the deed is done, it is interesting to learn a little bit from it. For example, up here, notice there's some writing on the wall. Modern day graffiti vandals, they like to use spray paint. But back in the golden old days, they didn't have spray paint. So they would write with charcoal or something like that. So usually instead of drawing art, they just wrote their name. Basically just said, hey everybody, look, I was here. I can't read that, it's been worn out. Not the biggest loss, but it is interesting that, you know, that might've been written a century ago. So you're looking at something a hundred years old. And then the vandalism was cross vandalized. Oh wow, so look at this. Look at that, 1891. Some of this I can't read. March 12, 1902. 1903, so it was over a hundred years ago if these people were telling the truth. Check it out, there's a little tunnel back there. My camera rig, I can't really light it up, but yeah, that looks pretty cool. Okay, so what, usually people do that when they're near the end of the cave to show they made it to the end of the cave. Look at the level, level the, the texture on that rock, it's kind of cool. Okay, I'm gonna find a way down to the right. So this basically splits three ways. I can go right or I can go left or I can go up. All three are dead ends very soon, especially since I'm not being particularly ambitious today. But notice I can still see natural light ahead. 